There are six restaurants feeding the 40,000 people here at COP21, the UN climate conference. But even the most eco-conscious diner creates food waste, more than a ton of it per day here. Handling that food waste is a two-year-old startup company called Molino Compost and Biogas. Meet the garbage man of COP21, owner Stefan Martinez. We are very uh, happy to collect the bio waste uh, in here, in the COP21, because it's the first time we have a, a big event. Martinez didn't start out in waste management. He's a restaurateur. He owns three around Paris. But he's passionate about his nightly excursions, making something useful out of food waste. For me, it's most important to do is uh, bio waste. It's 80% uh, of water. You don't have to put it in the incinerator. Instead, he sends it to a plant outside Paris that ferments that trash to make methane and burns the gas to make electricity. Okay, this is also kitchen waste. Serge Verdier heads Bio Nerval, the company that owns the plant. He says food waste contains a surprising amount of energy. The average quantity of waste generated to prepare a meal and some of uh, the small piece and pieces that you leave on your plate. When you take all this together, you can generate enough electricity to have your laptop work uh, for more than two hours. And France wants to generate more electricity from food waste. It's part of the country's plan to cut its greenhouse gas emissions. Cutting food waste, making electricity, protecting the planet. For restaurants, it can be a piece of cake. Steve Barragona, VOA News, Paris.